Bitcoin Explained Simply. This is Matthew. He works with online payment and his grandmother, Margaret, has just begun banking online. She's heard of Bitcoin, but doesn't know what it is. Matthew can explain. Everyone knows about money. We use cash or cards to buy things, either in shops or online. Bitcoin works in a similar way, but is a completely digital currency. It is created and stored electronically. The banks control Margaret's money, whereas it's the users themselves that control Bitcoin payments. Her money can be affected by inflation, but Bitcoin can't. By controlling production, they keep their value on quite a solid level. This makes it popular in countries with economic problems, as users can circumnavigate inflation and other issues. However, even small events, such as a bad press report, can have a drastic effect on Bitcoin price. So, where could Margaret use Bitcoins? Certain companies and online retailers now accept it as payment. However, Bitcoin is still relatively unknown by businesses, as it's a developing network. The simple and largely anonymous nature of Bitcoins has also made it attractive to criminals in the black market. From Matthew's perspective, Bitcoin is an app on a computer or smartphone that works as an online wallet. It's easier to make payments than with conventional debit or credit cards. Just enter the recipient's address, the amount to pay, and press send. Margaret can send and receive money instantly anywhere in the world and at any time. Unlike credit cards, there are either no or only small fees because there is no bank to go through and no personal or sensitive data is stored. Users each have their own address from which they can send and receive bitcoins. A collection or block of these transactions is then added to the blockchain, bitcoins equivalent of a bank's ledger. Users that maintain this form of accounting are rewarded with new bitcoins. This is known as mining. There is a fixed amount of bitcoins, but over time, existing bitcoins become divided to maintain a consistent value. Now that Matthew has explained bitcoins, Margaret doesn't find online payment to be all that complicated anymore. Bitcoin appears to be a real alternative form for worldwide currency for the future. En este momento el precio de Bitcoin es muy económico. Uh, at the moment the price of Bitcoin is very cheap. Pero casi todo el mundo tiene muy poco dinero para invertir. But almost everybody has a very little money to invest. Debería decir que esta idea me vino hoy especialmente cuando vi otra vez una chica ahí pidiendo dinero por la calle. Actually, I must say first this idea today I got especially when I saw again um, one girl begging for money in the streets. Me gustaría ayudar, pero yo tampoco me sobra mucho el dinero. I would really like to help everybody, but I, I don't have either too much money. And así que me vino la siguiente idea. So I got the following idea. It's, uh, it's más bien un juego. Uh, it's a rather a game. Um, lo que es muy importante elegir un monedero de Bitcoin que solo tú mismo misma, tienes la llave privada. What is very important uh, to choose um, Bitcoin wallet a company which you only possess the private key. For example, uh, blockchain.com.
info. Por ejemplo, la empresa blockchain.info. Luego imprimir en papel um, la llave privada y también guardarlo tú mismo. Then to print in paper the private key and uh, of course save for, for yourself that private key. Bueno, ya estamos imprimiendo, imprime por lo menos 10. So now we are already printing, so at least print 10 directions, 10 direcciones. Luego pones algo de Bitcoin, una cantidad, lo que, lo que te da la gana en esta dirección. Then you put some Bitcoin, uh, the amount, whatever you want, and that in these directions. Y la próxima vez que sales de casa ya tienes algo que dar a los que están ahí pidiendo por la calle. And the next time you go out of the house, you have already something to give for these people who are begging on the streets. Y por ejemplo, y claro, para tus amigos, amigas, and for your friends, of course. Eso da motivación a la gente para aprender Bitcoin y... This gives motivation for the people to learn about Bitcoin. Y la parte del juego consiste en lo siguiente. And the game part uh, consists in the following. Explicas a la gente, mira, esta es la cl clave privada, que es la clave secreta. You explain to the people, look, this is the private key, which must be secret. And uh, you have it and uh, me. And uh, explicas, esa persona y yo mismo la tiene. Y antes pensaba en cinco años, pero luego cambié un poco de idea de hasta cuatro años. First, I thought of five years, but then I changed uh, my opinion to four years. Later, explain. Después, lo expli explico por qué. Les dices, mira, tienes cuatro años para poner esta cantidad de Bitcoin a otra dirección. Si no lo, lo has quitado después de cuatro años, yo lo quito. So you explain them, you have four years to take this Bitcoin out of this direction, of this secret uh, key direction. If uh, you don't do it, uh, I do it after these four years. So you lose this. That's the, this part of the game. Es la parte del juego. He creado este hashtag uh, BTC4 para hacerlo un poco popular. I created this hashtag BTC4 to make it a little popular. Antes pensaba en cinco años, pero luego cambié a cuatro porque te has dado cuenta que en los Simpsons la gente tiene cuatro dedos. Y Solo do, Dios tiene cinco dedos. Um, first, I thought of five years, but then I changed my mind to four years. Um, did you notice that in The Simpsons, people have four fingers and only God has five fingers. Uh, I'll show some pictures. Voy a enseñar algunas imágenes de los Simpsons. De los manos y dedos de Simpsons. Some pictures of the hands and fingers of Simpsons. 
Uh, pero antes quiero recordar que um, es muy probable que en también cuatro o cinco en los próximos años el valor de Bitcoin puede subir mucho. Just want to remember before that uh, the price of Bitcoin, the value of Bitcoin can rise very much in these next years. Así que si solo pones una cantidad pequeña más tarde, puede ser de gran ayuda. Even if you just put a little small amount later, it can be a big help. Uh, no solo para... Bueno, es un juego. <laughs> si la persona lo quita antes de cuatro años, para, es para esta persona. Si no, es para ti. Si te recuerdas y guardas bien la llave privada. So, uh, it's... This is the game part. If the, the, the person takes the money out, it's for that person. But if they forget it after these four years, you can take it out. And it can be really... <laughs> bueno, imprimir también la llave pública y la llave privada. Y si, por ejemplo... Okay, first translate. Print and not just the private key, but on also the public key. Así que si, por ejemplo, explicas a la gente. Mira, si alguna persona quiere enviarte Bitcoin, pero tú no tienes ninguna dirección, así que puedes dar este, esta llave pública a la persona. Mira, muy bien, la llave pública, no la llave secreta das a esa persona o cualquier persona y te pueden enviar un Bitcoin a esa dirección. So, remember, uh, the public key you can give to anybody and if somebody wants to send you some Bitcoin and, you, and this person doesn't have any, so you have already this public address where they can send you Bitcoin. ¿Qué es Bitcoin? Bitcoin es la primera moneda digital descentralizada. Los Bitcoins son monedas digitales que puedes enviar a través de Internet. Comparado con otras alternativas, Bitcoin tiene numerosas ventajas. Los Bitcoins son transferidos directamente de persona a persona a través de la red sin pasar por un banco u otro intermediario. Esto significa que las comisiones son mucho menores, puedes usarlo en cualquier país, tu cuenta no puede ser congelada y no hay prerequisitos o límites arbitrarios. Miremos cómo funciona. Los bitcoins son generados en todo internet por cualquiera con un programa gratuito llamado Minero de Bitcoin. Crear bitcoins requiere una cierta cantidad de trabajo para cada bloque de monedas. Esta cantidad se ajusta automáticamente por la red, para que los bitcoins siempre sean creados a un ratio predecible y limitado. Tus bitcoins se guardan en tu billetera digital, que te resultará familiar si usas banca digital. Cuando transfieres bitcoins, una firma electrónica es añadida. Pasados unos minutos, la transacción es verificada por el minero y es almacenada permanente y anónimamente por la red. El software de Bitcoin es completamente abierto y cualquiera puede revisar el código. Bitcoin está cambiando las finanzas de la misma manera que la web ha cambiado el periodismo. Cuando cualquiera tiene acceso al mercado global, florecen grandes ideas. Miremos algunos ejemplos de cómo los Bitcoins están usándose hoy en día. Puedes comprar videojuegos, regalos, libros, servidores y calcetines de alpaca. Existen varias casas de cambio donde puedes intercambiar tus bitcoins por dólares, euros y más. Los bitcoins son una gran forma para que pequeños negocios y autónomos reciban publicidad. No cuesta nada empezar a aceptarlos, no hay cargos o comisiones y recibirás negocio adicional de la economía bitcoin. Para tus primeros bitcoins y más información visita weusecoins.com Bueno, ahora voy a enseñar algunas imágenes de los dedos de Simpsons. Now I'll show some pictures of the fingers of Simpson. The four fingers, los cuatro dedos y cinco dedos de Dios. The four fingers and five fingers of God of Simpsons.
13th of March. Right now, there are more people on the internet than there were on the planet in 1960. We're raising money. And it's easier to be discovered than ever before. It takes a full team to make each one of our videos. But the internet needs better software to help us reward one another for our work. Advertisers value you differently. They say that 1,000 of you is only worth $6. Any help is very much appreciated. Please fund this project. We need your help. Inherently and historically, opposed to secret society, secret oaths, and a secret proceedings. We decided long ago the dangers of excessive and unwarranted concealment. A pertinent fact far outweighs the dangers which are cited to justify it. Face the facts, join our hands, make a stand. Uh -huh. It's time to gather plans, get the shot, take the chance. Till there is no one left, stay correct to the death. They can't ever break a freedom, we will never let it. The corrupt politics is killing the system. Cynicism is it, and it's everything that you witness. They tell you what to think, make you believe that they're the realness. They feed us full of lies, and yet we always forgive them. Huh? It's all conspiracy, and if you're feeding in a witch, you're the puppet. The government's pulling strings from above you. It's time for the introduction to truth, and let's start a movement. We've all been brainwashed, they believe that we all are stupid. We believe in what we see, and whatever our ears are hearing. But if you look close, listen, gather your own opinion, you'll understand all the lies, lines, and what's between them. This world is not your oyster, this world is a fucking prison. Come on. happening in our nation. No one will stand up for the fear of assassination. So they strip us of everything. We stand there and just take it. We're scared to make a stand a false flag operation. Research Illuminati. Find out by 9-11. You see they line their pockets. Don't believe the lies they tell you. Find to seek the truth. Realize we need to do whatever it is we can to protect our livelihood. It's time for us to do when the conspiracy or not. They owe some explanations to the questions that we got. What are the skull and bones? What is lying beneath all these secretive means? Got you lying between your teeth. What's with the Bilderberg? I'm burning your effigies. I'm praying a Lucifer. How sickness can you be? While all of the time praying you believing in the peace. Just to keep up appearances within Christianity. Come on. Stay 
is drawing. They try to shut us down or turn around, let us storm. We got the warnings, let us march from the morning through the night. We gon' fight and close the eye and hope and throw all these damn secret societies. Why we gotta stand for the new world proprieties? The evidence is clear, we're naive to the lies. Illuminati wolves killing sheep.